Hello and welcome to another What's Inside. Today we are looking at Uno. This is of course a classic game that's been around for a couple decades now. It's for ages 7 and up, 2 to 10 players. This is the 2015 version of the game. There are 112 cards plus instructions, so let's take a look at what we've got. Now, this game has been around for ages, like I said, it's a classic. Uh, Mattel doesn't make a whole lot of really bad games that they keep producing. If it's not doing well, they let it go. And this one has been kind of a staple. There's a lot of variations on it now, which is kind of cool. So let's take a look inside and see what we've got. It's only held together with a little piece of sticker. Let's see if I can get this out without ripping it. Ha ha! I win. Alright, this is cool. I like that they wrap these. There's a lot of CCGs that don't even do this. So, that's cool. But you get two little decks. And here's your instructions. Real cheap little paper that just folds out. Tells you what the cards are. And that's about it. Uh, tells you the scoring, all that. Usual how to play stuff. And it does tell you how many of each color you've got. So we're going to see 19 blue cards, uh, 19 green cards, 19 red cards, 19 yellow cards, 8 draw twos, 8 reverses, 8 skip cards, 4 wild cards, Four wild draw four cards, one wild swap hands cards. That's an, a fairly new one. I've never seen that before. Uh, but I haven't played the Uno in a decade. Three wild customizable cards. So let's take a look at what we've got. So most of my friends have moved on to um, more complex games like Zombicide or different deck building games. So they never want to play Uno with me anymore. <laughs> So I usually play it on the computer. So these look a little smaller than previous sets, but that's probably better for kids, actually. So you can see that it's just pretty simplistic design, classic looking. It says Mattel in the corner. Not too bold or exciting, but it is a classic. So let's see what we've got here. There's one of our blank wilds. So you can kind of customize it, do your own thing. There's two of those. I thought there were supposed to be three. Maybe there's one in the other deck. Alright, then we've got a wild. There's draw four. They used to put the words on here, like these are draw twos that you say draw two, but this is probably so they can sell them internationally without only having to change minor things like the instruction sheet and the outer packaging. There's only one zero, which is kind of interesting. Because there's two of every other card, it looks like.
All right, let's look at the other deck. There's our third blank one. There's a swap hands. That looks really lazy <laughs> art. Some more wilds. Two more draw fours. All right, that's it. Card quality is good. They're a little slicker on one side than the other. At least that's how it feels. But card thickness isn't bad. Not quite playing cards, like bicycle cards, but nice quality. Shuffling them might be a little bit um, dangerous to them over time. But considering these box sets go for like five or six bucks, I would definitely say this is worth it. That's what the cards look like from the 2015 set, which I think is still the current one. It is a pretty nice set for the money. The quality is pretty solid. You probably will need a pencil and paper to keep track of score, so you'll want to be aware of that if you're on the road or something like that. But it is a decent travel game. You can play it at a small table, and kids seem to like it pretty well. So it could be fun for most of the family, ages 7 and up. Not bad little purchase. But we've seen what's inside. You heard my opinion on it. That's going to do it for this one. As always, thank you so much for watching and supporting the channel. If you enjoyed the video, be sure and hit the thumbs up. And consider subscribing so you don't miss future unboxings and reviews. If you want to help the channel in other ways, links are in the description and on the about page. And as always, we hope to see you on the next one.